At his inauguration ceremony today, UConn's 16th president, Thomas Katsalaeus, announced there will be free tuition for students coming from low-income households starting next fall. An afternoon of guest speakers, musical performances, and celebration ended with a big announcement from UConn's new president, a new financial aid program called Connecticut Commitment. For a family in Connecticut with a household income below $50,000 per year and typical assets, their child will be able to come to UConn tuition-free beginning next fall. Katsalaeus also shared his plan for new faculty hiring initiatives and his goal to make workforce experience and mentorship available to every student. UConn junior Joshua Crow said he supports the president's new tuition plan. I think it's uh, incredible. I think the more people that we can advantage with education, the better. UConn professor and director of the African American Cultural Center, Dr. Walina Kimson Price, said she's looking forward to the opportunities this plan will bring to students. A lot of all students, they need help, they need financial help, you know, with issues with the economy, with issues with their socioeconomic levels and all that. And to get that little push, what well, is more than a little one, it's a very generous push for our students to ensure that for those students who want to have a college education, they can afford it. Katsalaeus was appointed to UConn's presidency in February. He formerly served as the executive vice president and provost at the University of Virginia. Since his first day in August, Katsalaeus has been actively involved on campus, hosting coffee hour talks at the Beanery and skateboarding down Fairfield Way. He's been very receptive of our ideas and very encouraging, not just in the undergraduate student government, but through all throughout students on campus. So I really think that he's going to do a very good job. Students say they are looking forward to all the new changes that this president will bring to the university. For UCTV News, I'm Fiona Brady.